from Kalamazoo, direct to you. It's a WKZO.com quick cast. Good afternoon, Kalamazoo. It's Tuesday, September 1st, 2009. I'm Emily Wolfram, and this is your headline news from the 590 KZO Newsroom on WKZO.com. Kalamazoo has held a forum and rallies on health care. Monday, the City Commission unanimously approved a resolution endorsing health care reform. Citizens there were unanimous in their support as well. Commissioner Don Cooney says Congress needs to hear from someone other than insurance company lobbyists. Commissioners moved quickly to put the resolution together so their letter can be in Washington when after the debate resumes after Labor Day. Kalamazoo's Metro System has chosen a Missouri firm to take over operation of the Caravan and Metrovan bus services and will combine them into one new operation, and it's nearly an $8 million deal. Director Bill Shomish says the bid from the Apple bus company beat the current provider, Pride Ambulance. They plan to call the combined service Metro County Connected. Portage School will be busing some kids to the 12th Street Elementary after all. Hundreds of parents signed petitions and complained that forcing them to walk put them in danger. The school district has sent out letters to parents notifying them that they will bus kids from the west side of 12th Street. The concern was students walking along 12th Street, which has a 45 mile hour per speed limit and only a narrow bike path along the northbound lane. Officials in Van Buren County are looking for ways to cut the cost of maintaining the Calhaven Trail. Currently, the road commission there is responsible for maintaining the county's portion of the 34.5-mile recreational trail. However, in recent years, the cost of those services has been catching up with the revenue that the trail brings in. County Administrator Doug Caltra says the Board of Commissioners remains committed to the system, but members want to see if money could be saved by privatizing its maintenance. A panel is being set up to determine just what the trail needs and who might be contra contracted about performing those services. The whole process could take about a year. And now you're up to date with everything Kalamazoo. From the 590 KZO Newsroom on WKZO.com, I'm Emily Wolfram.